गुड मॉर्निंग स्टूडेंट्स इन माय प्रीवियस वीडियो आई हैव गिवन यू चैप्टर थर्टीन सेट्स टाइप्स ऑफ सेट्स एंड टोल्ड दैट नेक्स्ट टॉपिक आई विल टेल इन नेक्स्ट वीडियो सो नाउ दैट सेट इन सेट कॉन्सेप्ट व्हाट इज सबसेट द टॉपिक इज सबसेट ओके व्हाट इज सबसेट सबसेट इज सपोज अ सेट इज सेट ऑफ नेचुरल नंबर इज वन टू थ्री फोर फाइव सिक्स एंड डैश 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 एंड इवन नंबर दैट इज टू फोर सिक्स एट टेन टिल टेन ओनली ऑड नंबर ऑड दैट इज वन थ्री फाइव सेवन नाइन सो वी कैन से ई एंड ओ आर सबसेट ऑफ नेचुरल नंबर सो हाउ वी कैन denoted subset of natural number o is subset of natural number and the symbol of subset is this okay it means what it is subset and equal also that n n is we can say n is subset of n also here subset we can say a set is also subset of itself okay a set is also subset of itself now superset what is superset superset is n is superset here super means superior you can say which is super here n so n is superset of e we can say n is superset of e because n is superior here in n all the numbers are there all the elements are there of e and o so this is superior so we can say superset n is superset of e and is superset of o also understood now proper subset what is proper subset proper means properly which is properly just now i have told for this one for subset n is also subset of n but here we can not say n is proper subset of n because n is equal to n n is equal to n yes we can say e is proper subset of n and the sub symbol of proper subset is only this one which is never equal to the superset o is proper subset of n which is smaller than n proper subset a proper subset is always smaller than the superset okay superset that is n here okay so these are the subsets superset and proper subset proper set we can say proper subset it is subset sorry for that i have forgotten proper subset okay now next is if any set is there how many number of subsets and how many number of proper subsets are there okay that is number of subsets and number of subsets and proper subsets of a set okay suppose you have given n equal to 2 3 and 4 okay this will be so a subset will be how many subsets are there subset equal to for your information kind of information i want to tell that empty set is the subset of all all the sets empty sets because empty is there everywhere so empty set will be subset of all sets so one subset is this then another is this single two single three and single four 
cylinder is over now 2 3 double double 3 4 double double 4 2 or 2 4 we can take 2 4 double double and that is 2 3 4 how many subsets are there 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 8 subsets are there so by formula we can say number of subset equal to 2 to the power n where n is number of elements n is number of elements so 2 to the power n here 3 elements are there so 2 to the power 3 equal to 8 so how many subsets are there we can count 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 8 subsets are there for 3 elements of set 3 elements of a set and how many proper sets are there proper set subset in which this one will not be there because 2 3 4 this is super set also a super set is subset of itself but it is not a proper subset now for proper subset what is the formula of proper subset if we erase this one then number of proper subset number of proper subset that is 2 to the power n minus 1 so what it will be 2 to the power 3 minus 1 equal to 8 minus 1 equal 7 now proper subsets are there 7 we can count 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 ok so these were the number of proper subset and subset so the formula of subset number of subset that is equal to 2 to the power n and number of proper subset that is 2 to the power n minus 1. Okay. Now, universal set. What is universal set? Suppose A equal to 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. B equal to 9, 10, 11, 12. C equal to 1920. Now, a universal set will be denoted like this E. Okay, that is just like the E. E. And 1, 2, 3, 4, dash, 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 1920. Means still 20, all the numbers are here. That is universal set in which all the numbers, all the, the elements of given set should be there. So, this will be universal set. So, we can say that universal set that in geometry, geometrical figure, all the geometrical figure, okay, all the geometrical figure and set of triangle, set of quadrilateral, set of pentagon, set of, set of all, and other polygons. So, these, all these sets, universal set be what? Set of geometrical figure, okay. Now, 30 C is based on only this uh, set, subset and superset and number of set, subset and superset. Now, union of set, operation on set. Operation on sets. First is Union of sets. Union of sets. What it is? Union means summation, addition. Suppose two sets are there. A equal to suppose 2, 4, 6, 8, 10. B equal to 1, 3, 5, 7, 9. So A union B we can write 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. All the numbers of all the elements of these two sets. 
will be a union b we are all the all the elements in this one set a union b now second one intersection inter section of sets what is intersection of set that is suppose a equal to 1 3 5 7 11 like this and b equal to 1 3 and uh, suppose take 1 2 3 1 2 3 4 okay then a intersection b equal to what which one will be the common elements one is common in both three is common in both so a intersection b equal to 1 and 3 so common elements you have to take in a intersection b understood students now next one is subtraction of sets subtraction of sets that is difference we can say difference of sets difference of sets if a equal to you have given 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 Like this, and b equal to given. Uh, you have given two, four, six, eight. Like this. So if a minus b, you have to do a minus b. In a, which numbers are? Which elements are present in b? Those elements we don't take. See, two common, four common, six common. so the elements in set a which are not present in b are a minus b 1 3 5 7 7 the element of a which are not element of b is the element of a minus b okay similarly if b minus a b do B minus a two is there, four is there, six is there, but eight is not there. So we can write eight. B minus a. B is those elements which are not present in a. That is B minus a. And a minus b is those element, those element of set a which are not present in set b. That is a minus b. Understood, students? So this. Work the operation on sets. Okay. Now some cardinal properties are there. That also I want to tell cardinal properties which you can use in exercise. These are very important. Okay, then we have to find out N A union B. So find out 
A union B. This formula you can use here. N A equal to 75 plus N B equal to 65 minus N A intersection B 45. 140 minus 45, 10 minus 5, 5. Here it is in, uh, 13. 13 minus 4, 9. 95 is in A union B. Okay. So this was the first question of 70D. 7th question. 7th first question. Now next one is. Next formula. N A intersection B. Just opposite of it. N A plus L B minus L A union B. Means what? This A intersection B came here and this A union B went there. Okay. This is third formula. Now, if A and B are disjoint, if A and B are disjoint, Then A intersection B equal to 5 and A 5 means empty set and A intersection B cardinal number of A intersection B will be 0. If empty set is there then cardinal number of A intersection B will be 0. So N A union B equal to N A plus L B plus 0 that is equal to plus 0 or minus 0 ok and in place of N A intersection B you put 0 so N A union B equal to N A plus N B if intersection will be 5 or null set <coughs> ok fourth one N A minus B equal to N A minus L A intersection B and L B minus A equal to L B minus L A intersection B. Okay, so these are the formula which you can use in exercise 13D. Okay students, so solve all the sums of 13D and all the exercise. Okay. So this was chapter 13. Set concept. Set concept. So in set concept. Everything. Uh, I explained. So solve all the sums. And in my next video. Now next chapter I will give you. Till then. Thank you children.